Thanks for tuning in to WSKI TV 17. Good morning and welcome to everyone here on New Hampshire Vacation Week. Should be a great week of skiing and riding and enjoying the main High Peaks region here for you. This weather report is brought to you by Gepe Geppettos. Check them out in Village West, the place to be anytime, day or night. And they've got a great two for Tuesday happening Tuesday night right up in Village West. Well, we'll see that sunshine getting uh, brighter today as we go throughout the day, becoming mostly sunny. 4 to 8 for your summer temperatures, 15 to 19 for your base temperatures with a light northwest breeze across the mountain. You probably want to wear those mittens today rather than those gloves and have that face mask handy as well as it will be a bit cool especially the higher up you get on the mountain. Tuesday we'll see mostly sunny skies increasing clouds in the afternoon a south wind 12 to 20 miles an hour summer temperatures continue in the lower teens base temperatures in the lower 20s and uh, we'll see that south wind bring up some warmer air we'll see Wednesday things start out as some snow and some sleet so get out there early may get some fresh snow out of that and then things will warm up and we'll see a few showers on the tail end of that uh, wrapping up on Thursday. As you can see, high temperatures in the upper 40s before things gradually start to cool down for the weekend. Monday, February 22nd, your Birchwood Interiors Trail Report. They're located in Village West and online at birchwoodinteriors.com. Bunch of great deals over there. Check that out. 92 trails of skiing right on, 9 lifts getting into those runs. 61 trails got groomed out last night. And we're looking at machine groomed over packed powder surfaces. Anything uh, mid-mountain up stayed all snow over the weekend, so conditions are great up there on the hill. Timberline, Bridal Chain, Tote Road, King's Landing, Hayburner, Narrow Gauge, Comp Hill all got groomed out last night. They groomed out uh, Gandhi line from the top as well as white nitro uh, so go check those out Widowmaker flume haul back ram down lower boom auger wiffle tree and two hall on the east side all the trails around the base area got groomed out and all the terrain parks got some work as well they were going to work on uh, make sure to groom out haul back that should be great right underneath the king pine lift as well as get flume going again uh, over on the east side double runner east that gets going at 8 30 this morning uh, the Skidway Sawduster chairs, those get going moving around the base area at 8.30 this morning as well. Super Quad and Skyline get going at 8.30. Number 3 T-Bar is always on demand. Uh, Super Quad gets you to a variety of mid-mountain terrain. And Skyline gets you up to Spillway Crosscut. That allows you to branch out all across the mountain. Uh, Wiffle Tree and King Pine, those lifts are the lifts that service the east sides of the mountain. Uh, King Pine's a great uh, quad, gets you to some great expert terrain. Uh, go check out Flume as they did some work on that last night. Widowmaker to Flume's a great run uh, over on the east side. And Wiffle Tree is a nice fast super quad with some intermediate terrain over there. And Timberline gets going at 9 a.m. as well. And that gets you right up to the top of the mountain. Trails closed until further notice down the Chicago Outdoor Center. The skating rink is closed until midweek as well as they try and resurface that. 20K of snowshoeing is available. And don't forget about the cafe and the retail shop are open. It's a great spot to go eat lunch and hang out down there or even go for a walk in the woods on the snowshoe trails. Chase's Trivia tonight at the Rack. If you're looking for something to do, a great time. Some good prizes to give away. Uh, and great trivia as well. They've got some live music going on tomorrow night, on Tuesday night, and then as always on Wednesday is the open mic, which always has a bunch of great local mu musicians doing their thing right down at the bottom of the access road, the rack. Also, check us out online. We're on Facebook, we're on Twitter, we're on Instagram. You can also find us on our website, WSKITV.com, where you can always find this latest local forecast updated twice daily. We've got lots of videos on there as well of things to do to keep you busy while you're here in the main High Peaks region. Each one of those a reason to stay another day.